time. All right, Red Dead Redemption, let's do it. So I think we're about to attack the fort or something, I think. The hat, you guys, I know, I know, the, the hat, the hat is like the best thing I've done. Like, people fucking love the hat, dude. They love my fedora. <laughs> I don't even know, this, is, this clearly is not a fedora. I don't know what you would fucking call this hat, though. You know what I'm saying? I don't know what this hat is. Is this, is this my horse? I guess it's my horse. Even know what's my horse, what isn't my horse. Okay, oh, let me, uh... A trilby? Is that what this hat is? I don't even know, I don't know what to call it. A Stetson? Maybe. I don't know. I'm not well versed on hat lore. Oh, it's, it's right over here. Oh, I bet it's, dude, I bet it's gonna tell me to come back at, like, whatever. Dude, I don't want you as a fucking friend. Go away. <laughs> Leave me alone. I'm not your friend, guy. Okay, well, we've done a great job riding. Oh, no, we get to start. Cool. This is a, this is a fedora? Is, I, this is not a fucking fedora. This is not a fedora. Hey, miss. I got most of the horses secure and the chicken. Well, thank you, Amos, but it's the herd I'm worried about. I know. They're scattered all over the valley and beyond. The oh, boy. coming in real fast. So what do you suggest, Amos? We leave the herd out there to be scattered by the storm and ourselves left here to die without a livelihood? Can I help? No, miss. If the men get caught out in that storm, they're gonna die. And if we lose our herd, we'll all die, you stupid man. Doesn't sound like we're left with much of a choice then. Come on, Amos. Round up your men. Let's get the herd. Dang. It's a hat. <laughs> Yo, Agchi. Oh, uh, I think you're a little off there. Uh, thank you for the resub. I appreciate that. Thank you, Agchi. Not quite. We're not doing a pirate thing right now. Somebody's poisoned the water hole. Sometimes I tell myself things happen for a reason. Well, more talking while we ride. Ride him good, ride him hard. The lightning is gorgeous. Yeah, this this game in general looks fantastic. It looks it's really well done. Can you see the top of the hat? Sure. You want to, yeah. There, there you go. There's the top of the hat. Let's talk you more shooty. What's up, Japan? It's a top hat? I don't think it's a top hat. Let's take them over to the other herd. We try to drive them all back to the ranch together. Move the herd to the old oak tree, okay? We haven't seen a widow's peak in three days. I don't wear a hat during the day stream. What are you fucking blind? This, this, I come from Florida. This rain is nothing. Come on, you straggler cow. How do I? How do I destroy the stragglers? There we go. I change between streams. <laughs> Dude, oh, there's a straggler for sure, right? Florida rain is no fucking joke. There's like rain, and then there's like it's like tropical jungle rain and shit. That's uh, that's a whole different level of rain. The Twilight Princess teach me nothing. I was I was too busy sleeping through the intro of Twilight Princess. They're spooked. Do something. They're heading for the cliff. Oh boy. They're heading for the cliff. Can I like stop them? Turn around, idiots. Can I like shoot? Stop! Stop running! <laughs> 
No, no, that's a cliff. That's a cliff. Not the cliff. <laughs> Not the cliff. Okay, well, it looks like I saved them, I think. Right. No cattle were killed. Good. You know, I gotta say, this is fucking thrilling gameplay right now. <laughs> Let's go. I, I think you overestimate how, how rootin' tootin' tough I am. <laughs> I do sit in my chair and play video games all day. Ugh. Round up the stragglers. It's like the never-ending Twilight Princess tutorial here. You think that it's never done? There's just there's always more. Back to the herd, you varmint. <laughs> what in barb nation? How's it going, Samus? A cattle herding race? Please, God, no. You don't know why uh, cars in Florida don't have turbo speed? I love, uh, I love Florida rain. The thing is, like, so we moved to North Carolina from Florida, and we occasionally get some pretty hard rain here, but that's, that's not usual. And if there's one thing I miss about Florida, it's, uh, Florida rain. Definitely miss that. The thunderstorms, the... Just everything. You love warm rain? Uh, yeah. I mean, getting rained on always sucks for the most part. Boy, this this herding cattle shit is just endlessly fascinating. Praise the hat. Cold rain can shiver you. Is that a skunk? What the fuck was that? There was a skunk or something? What is that? Is that a raccoon? Oh, well, whatever it was, I killed it. <laughs> I don't know what it was. Yo, what's up there, Ann? Come on. What's up, Matthew? Kill it. I did kill it. Nice shooting text. Thanks, man. It's a lizard? That was a that was a large furry lizard. We need to stick together. What's up, Hanlon? Alright, shut up. Jeez, man. What's up, JMR? You saved the herd back there. You might make a decent rancher one day. Thank you, Miss McFarland. Yeah. yeah. Pretty exciting shit. Why did I have to do that? Like, at all? Honor, Honest Joe? What? Have they not seen some of the horrifying shit I've done to people? Like, look, I'll, I'll do some horrifying shit right now. Where's my lasso? Like, have they not, have they not seen the things I do to people? Oh, the law is coming! Shit, run! <laughs> the police are coming. Oh, shit. I didn't even kill the guy. I just lassoed him for like five seconds. Come on, man. This is bullshit. You lasso one guy for like five seconds, and then the police are coming to literally execute me. Come on, man. I thought this was America. I'm still, I'm still wanted. My honor is too high. Uh, I snidely whiplashed, so I saved the dude last night from coyotes or something, and then I tied him up and put him on the train tracks. And he turned into a cloud of, when he got hit by the train, he turned into a cloud of mist. It was pretty awesome. 
Can you lasso the sheriff? I don't know. How are you guys doing? What's up with you guys? It was a red mist. Yeah, we, we breathed it in. We inhaled his strength. <laughs> it was mystifying. Excuse me, Mr. Marston. Have you seen my father anywhere? No. He went out this morning to ride the land and was supposed to be back hours ago. I don't know. The ranch hands have been out looking, but so far they've found nothing. Well, come on. Let's go look for him. What's up, Liquid? Thank you, Mr. Marston. I'm sure it's nothing, but I worry about the old fool. Uh-huh. Come on, boy. What's up, Liquid? Dude, there's like eight liquids in my chat right now. You guys really like liquids. Not like him to be away for so long. Where's the solids? We'll find him. Where's the gases and where's the solids? What if he's hurt himself? Your father can still handle himself just fine, Miss McFarland. He's built like an oak. You're probably right, but I can't help worrying. <laughs> He's all I've got. 105 gigs to install? What the fuck? It's because liquids are moist. So, a, there's a solid, there's solid liquids and gas. So is a liquid, the state between, the liquid must be between the state of solid and gas, right? That's how that works. And that has to do with the expansion and contraction of like atoms and molecules and shit, right? Something like that. I see those city fellers coming in on the railway, all dressed up like a sore toe. I feel like with water, right? Sort of. I haven't taken I haven't taken a science class in an extremely long time. <laughs> it's been a long time. I think I see someone. The heck? Quick if you can. Uh, we're gonna have to get into a gunfight, aren't we? Oh shit! That's a lot of dead bodies. Pressers, I guess. Maybe the Baller twins, that bunch. Now you head back to the ranch right now and fetch a wagon. Yes, sir. Marston, you watch after her. I'll do that, sir. Stay with me. I've got a bad feeling about this. What could have happened to those poor men? And their horses were dead too. Okay. I think we should you like my hat, thanks, man. Who could have done this is my fedora. Like See, when I met my wife. I, I was wearing this and I was like, m'lady, and, and today we're married. Worked out really nicely. Those damn rustlers. <laughs> I've got a good mind to head over to Pike's Basin myself. I don't think that's a good idea. And you're no better. How many men hmm. have you killed? Do you really want to know? It's disgusting. You never met the men I killed. It works, I yeah. the way you talk about that gang you were in. Like there was some twisted morality to what you did. We all have a code. Only some of us don't realize I just dream more in this hat. How wonderfully romantic. Are there you know, are there any Indiana Jones video games? I want an Indiana Jones video game. Uh Rath, thank you for the bits. The barn, no. They're burning the barn. Tomb Raider? Is that an Indiana Jones game? Okay. Somebody's poisoned the water hole. Hey. Or playing Assassin's Creed now. Yo, you know, I should play those on stream. Oh, God. <laughs> I should play uh, Assassin's Creed like 1, 2, and 3 or something. Maybe, maybe up just through two, like Brotherhood or something. I don't know. Something like that. It could be fun. Oh god. Maybe someday. Skip three and go four. I didn't. I did not like Assassin's Creed. Uh, wait, where? Where the fuck am I going? I did not like Assassin's Creed three. I did like the two. Uh, two though. They're pretty. Uh, they're pretty narrative heavy games though. Whoa! I'm gonna fall off the barn. I think uh, the more narrative your game is, the worse it is to stream. Usually. Woo! Woo! Uh-oh. 
Oh, I think I land. I just jumped on that horse. The horses! Come on, horsies! Smack the horsies' butt! Uh oh. Let's go! Oh yeah, that was easy. <laughs> I was expecting something maybe a little bit harder, but no, that was it. Kodor? It's, it's nearly impossible to stream. Uh, well, there's the... What's it called? It's on Xbox 360 uh, Marketplace or whatever. So... Yes, John, I, I, the, when I streamed it, I streamed it on Steam, and it was awful on Steam. The game kept softlocking on me. It was terrible. I'm a real hero. Banger! Yeah, well... My father fought Indians. I scarcely think we're gonna be frightened by some white trash. White trash can be pretty frightening. Well, they don't frighten me. Good. John. You made a hot pocket? My family owes you a great debt. I think you got enough debt. The pepperoni hot pockets are my favorite. All I ask you is this. If I get back home and get my farm started back up, you'll sell me some cattle. I prefer doing business with people I know. Of course, Mr. Marston. It'd be my pleasure. Um, well... Cheeseburger Hot Pockets? I don't think I've ever had a cheeseburger Hot Pocket. You haven't had a Hot Pocket in 10 years? I haven't had a Hot Pocket in a very long time. It's been a long time. I like how they give me a hat. when I'm Even when I'm not wearing a hat. The game's just like, here, you need a hat. <laughs> All right, are we okay? So it looks like we're done with all the B for bullshit missions. So now we have the M for uh, hopefully M for murder. Sorry, mister. Is what I'm hoping. Let's go get my horse. Let's go. Uh, let's get to murdering. Chicken and broccoli ones. I think I know those. I think I've had those. Oh, that's a good puppy. I would never hurt the puppy. Ham and cheese. What a nice puppy. Steal the dog, you ride the dog. Shoot the puppy? No, you're you're an animal. I would never do anything like that. I just I just love murdering. Eat it. Well listen, I was starving. I that was that was life or death. That was a life or death situation. I had to eat that dog. I did not have a choice. Listen, if it comes down to my life or or Spot's life, you know, Spot looks pretty tasty. <laughs> if you're going to make me choose. There was a game, there was a game called Kingdom Come where I I got put in prison for strangling a woman or something like that. So they put me in prison. And, but they didn't give me any food, so when I got out, I was literally dying of starvation. So the first thing I had to eat, the, f the first thing I could eat was a dog. I killed a dog and I ate it. <laughs> I had to do it to survive or I was going to die. It was life or death. It was me, me or Fido. Fido had to go. Did I ever finish that game? I mean, I finished everything that was on the game in initial release. I want to play the game again from the very beginning, but right now I'm waiting for all of the DLC. I've had I've had many adventures. I think this is going to be the big mission. There we go. Hanging Bonnie McFarlane. Hi, 
but it's gotta be something to do with that government boy. We'll talk to him, find out what he knows. He fucking is. Where is she, Marston? Who? Who? My daughter, you fucking scum! Where's Bonnie? I don't know. I haven't seen her since after the fire. Why? Why? Because she hadn't been seen since yesterday afternoon. You know, I don't think I can cope. If I lose another child... Now, Drew, nobody's lost anything yet. I'm sure she's fine. Oh, Mr. Marshall! Mr. Marshall! Come out uh -oh. wherever you are! Who the hell's that? Hey, buddy! <laughs> that be your next fucking mayor. It got you into scribing? Good day, Mr. McFarland. Get down from that horse, boy, or I'll shoot. <laughs> I wouldn't recommend that, mister. Not if Drew McFarland wants to see his bony back in one piece. Hey, Mr. McFarland! This is a nice girl you got there. Get down from there! You know, part of me's got the thinking I should just marry her myself. Give her a baby and that. What do you want? That's better. I want Norman Deke. I want him set free. Then you'll get your daughter back, mister. We don't do deals with outlaws, boy. Yeah, you do! Let's not waste each other's time pretending otherwise. Whole government themselves ain't much more than a bunch of crooks. This is the land of opportunity, mister. And I'm giving you the Topical. opportunity to get your daughter back before 15 friends of mine take out all their anger and their loneliness on her. Where the hell is she? Where is she, boy? Bring Deke up to Tumbleweed in a couple hours. And don't get no funny ideas, or I will slit that horse throat myself. You boys have a pleasant afternoon. Yeah! When is this supposed to take place? Apparently 1911. Apparently. Says, you and me, Marshal. Mr. McFarland, I'll get you your daughter back. I owe her that. Please do. Like five seconds ago, he was ready to fucking blame me for everything, and now he's shaking my hand. <laughs> now we need somebody murdered. Hurry up, boy. Let's go. Quick as you can, deputy. Make sure he's tied on good. Stay with me, Marshall. Yo. I won't let anything happen to him, sir. Yo, Cobalt, thank you for the tier three. Uh, thank you for the tier three 18 months. Uh, thank you so much, Cobalt. I appreciate that. Hope you're doing well. See, this is what happens when the thank Federals you, dude. interfere in our affairs. Are you happy now? No, I ain't happy at all. And I already told you, I ain't with the government. Now you say that, What's up, Brian? How you doing? The thing I know for sure is who sent you. They made me come here. They gave me no choice. That's your federal... Slogging through some D3 season 5. What's D3? Diablo 3? I wish it was cool, still cool to wear gloves like that. I agree with you. Wolves and sheep clothing. I don't, yeah, I don't know what D3 is. Oh, Diablo 3, okay. I have never played the Diablo games. Never played them. People around here have been fooled into feeling protected when they're worse off than they were before. The fellas I know don't care about people. All they care about is lining their pockets. Dante's Inferno on Xbox Series. I remember one of my friends played a shitload of when, when Dante's Inferno came out. He played like nothing else. He was he was obsessed with that for a while. A glorified errand boy. Marshal, I'll be back for you. Bill standards have slipped. We already filled you with leather. Nine pairs of leather sandals. <laughs> it's not Twitch friendly. Why is that? Dark Souls. Yeah, Dark Souls has seasons. They got enjoyed Diablo too. I know Di people love Diablo too. I know that. Never. I never played it. What is this place we're headed? Tumbleweed, a lonely, godforsaken place. Some people say it's haunted. It was quite a town back in its day. Then they built the railroad to Armadillo and went clean past Tumbleweed. And that was that. Pretty soon everybody had up and left. Now it's just thieves, smugglers, and bandits. You fight a giant titty monster with those infants that spawn from her titties. That sounds awesome. <laughs> Sounds amazing. I just hope you're not taking advantage of the McFarland, Marston. They saved my life. Gave me food and bed when they had no idea. It's on the list. Was. Diablo oh, 3 for Switch. I yeah, I heard about that, yeah. That's just they've been through a lot. You're not exaggerating? <laughs> Different way. I would love to try it. Uh Creepy Dolphin, thanks for the hundred bits. I know you help. Just like you help me. 
You got your reasons for doing it. It's no secret why I'm here, Marshal. I told you the very first time I walked into your office. I trust you. It's just all this business with Blackwater and Williamson in the past. I don't know. Sometimes it's hard not to have doubt. I understand. I never planned to be in the lawman business neither. This yeah, this game has a shitload of talking in it. Sending an outlaw to do the work of a lawman. That's madness. Ain't much difference between the two, as far as I can tell. There have to be rules, Marston. Yo. Even you must understand that. Dabum, thank you so much for the gift sub. Thank you, Dabum. I appreciate that. Like my son. Uh, thank you so much. He'll do it anyways, just to spite me. If I punish him, he resists me for it. But if I show him why it's wrong, he has reason not to do it again. That's nonsense. Without laws, we're nothing more than animals. Just look at Deke here. Go to hell! Man has worked hard at civilization. Your boy steps out of line, you whack him. He does it again, whack him hard. You're a good man, Marshal. Aw, uh, Rath, thank you for the bits. Shit. What I've seen since I've arrived here, Sounds cool. Really Criminals are like weeds, Marston. There's a lot of fucking talking in this game. Holy shit. So nature of places. You know uh, thanks, Chief. The problem with laws is everybody ain't the same. Why should a bunch of rich university boys in the east only a coward has to have a page? It's for the lore. A Kmart brand crocodile, crocodile Dundee. Listen, you must be pretty old because nobody re nobody remembers Kmart. <laughs> you must be kind of old. Kmart was pretty witty, man. Imagine them in the studio just speaking bullshit lines like this all day long. I wonder how many times and I wonder how many times they had to do a line where there was like. Ugh, Ugh. Ugh. They probably had to do that into the microphone for like hours. <laughs> Besides, Norm here is going to be my shield, ain't you, Norm? It'd be my pleasure. Piggly Wiggly. Lead Deke into town. Make sure you keep a gun on that son of a bitch. Okay. <laughs> well, I kept a gun on him. <laughs> Can I shoot off his hat? I'm sure it's been nice for the boys to have a whore to play with. I was just trying to shoot off his hat. God damn it. <laughs> I wanted to just take his hat off. I'm sure it's been nice for the boys to have a whore to play with. Can you walk faster? Oh shit! Damn it, I wasn't actually trying to shoot him. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna stop. Am I gonna do no, I, I did it before a long time ago, and I'm not gonna do it again. I didn't I didn't really find it all that entertaining. I hear those rancher girls like it in the rear. Maybe she won't wanna go home. She's been fucked so good. Come on, let's go. What are you waiting for? Untie me, fillers. Where's Bonnie? Are they gonna kill him? We had a deal. Well, you thought wrong. We don't make deals with the law. Woo! It's a trap! We gotta save Bonnie! At least we're not fucking talking anymore. Hang on, I want to turn off auto aim. We're gonna turn off auto aim here. Where is it? Targeting mode? Is this it? Casual? What's normal? Expert? Is it expert? Is that what I want? I think it might be expert. I'm a fucking. I'm an expert. God damn it! I'm a once god tier Mario player. <laughs> Shoot the horses! Oh shit! They're killing Bonnie! No! You ain't outlaws! You're idiots! 
They're gonna fucking kill Bonnie. Oh shit, where is she? Oh god. Save Bonnie! Hey, I saved Bonnie. Okay, well Bonnie's alive, so that's good. I shot him in the leg as he was running away. Are you, are you, I think he's still alive. I was gonna, hang on, he's alive? Oh no! Lasso him! <laughs> Lasso, don't shoot me. I got him, I got him. They're fucking like, look at it, they're shooting at him. <laughs> shoot him guys, he's right here. <laughs> oh, they killed my prisoner. They killed my prisoner. <laughs> that was like target practice. Uh, Louie, thank you for the gift sub. I appreciate that. Thank you, Louie. Bonnie, are you okay? I'm fine now, Mr. Marston. Thank you. Thank you. What the hell took you so long, you stupid man? Well, you weren't exactly helping me. If you think I'm gonna lower myself by making a joke about being all tied up, you got another thing coming. Come on. <clears throat> Was that like a fourth wall kind of deal? <laughs> he like looked into the camera for a second. Yeah, she's fine. I think I'm gonna enjoy the game a lot more. It's gonna be a lot harder, but I'm I'm gonna enjoy it a lot more this way. I think. Only real Barb fans watch the Red Dead stream. Uh, I don't. There are no Barb fans. There's just people waiting for Ryu to stream. <laughs> no, I I played this game a long time ago. You're gonna play Indiana Jones? The Barbettes. The, it's the Ryu waiting room, right? Hey, you know what? This is the, I learned this a long time ago about being a streamer. Everybody, everybody is somebody's waiting room. Everybody is somebody's waiting room, my man. I remember back in the day, um, when Mario Maker first came out, uh... Panga, Panga used to be like the biggest Mario to make a streamer like he would have two or three thousand viewers and he'd be making a level even even more and uh, Yo uh, Consequence, thank you so much for continuing that gift sub. I appreciate that. Uh, thank you so much But yeah, like back in the day when Panga would get like two or three thousand viewers playing um, Playing Mario Maker and he'd be making making a level or something like that and then afterwards Panga would host Poo or host who or host whoever, you know. People would be like, "Oh wow, you're you're just you're just pet you're just uh Poo Panga's waiting room. You're just this and that." It's it's so funny, you know. It's funny because now now Poo is like the biggest Mario Maker streamer for the most part, with like maybe like there's like two or three people who could compete, you know. But I don't know. I just, it's just it's just funny. That's just the way Twitch works, you know. Oh yeah, yeah. Back when Mario Maker was first out. Pang, and, Pang, and you know what's funny is that Pango would have like two, three, five thousand viewers, something like that. But he had no mic or cam because he had his roommates at the time. <laughs> he had no mic or cam, he just had those crazy viewers. Uh, I wouldn't say Carl is the biggest streamer because Carl doesn't stream that consistently. I think, I think consistency matters a lot. I'd say probably like the biggest Mario Maker streamer on Twitch is probably Orator at this point. Because Aura streams, Aura is consistent and pulls in... 2,000 viewers plus, you know? I would say Aura is the biggest Mario Maker streamer. In, ter in terms of just like raw view count, you know what I mean? In terms of subs, maybe you'd say Pooh. Uh, Louie, thank you for 300 bits. Oh, I just ran past the place I gotta go. Oh yeah, there's no doubt like, Pooh plays a lot of other games, including SMW and he does a lot of speedrunning. 
Aura pretty much only plays Mario Maker. Like, he does, he dabbles in some other games, but he's predominantly a Mario Maker streamer for sure. So. You only know about Aura because of Barb's impressions? Well, Aura streams at a really weird time of the day, so. Are we attacking the fort finally? He streams way too late. Yeah, he's got his particular, he's got his hours, you know. I think we're attacking, yep. Gentlemen, <clears throat> it's time. We must go. Why? What's happening? Seth has managed to get himself inside, <laughs> but we can't leave it too long, or they will soon realize how very curious he is and remove him from the premises, or slit his throat and watch him bleed to death. But for a minute. He will delight and amuse them. That's when he'll get us inside. Okay. Marshals of the law. When the shooting starts, take that. <laughs> I like Wes Dickens. I like him. I, his missions were shit, but I like the character. To get inside and clean up the mess. Oh. All I care about is Williamson. It is vital we stop him. Agreed. That man is a stone cold killer. Williamson's a proud fool. The question is which will win out between his pride and his instinct for survival. I like that I turned off the auto aim thing in the game, which is the normal aim, by the way. I turned that off right before like a really hard part where you have to do a lot of shooting. <laughs> I couldn't have picked a better time. Esconce yourself in the back of my wagon, John, so that we can make our grand entrance. Okay. Genius. No, I'm playing Xbox One. Come on. Let's go. All right, good. Now just stay put till I tell you otherwise. That scoundrel Seth had better not let us down. Once we're inside and I've lulled our adversaries into a false sense of security with some beguiling sales patter, I will give you the signal. What signal? The moment you hear a sharp rap on the side of the wagon, rise like the phoenix and start shooting like you've never shot before. This is it, my dear boy. The moment of truth. Me and you, John. One last time into the breach. This is going to have to be the performance of my life. I hope my nerves don't get the better of me. I'll be honest with you, John. I'm a little jittery. John? John? It reeks of miracles back here. Thank God. Now be ready with that machine gun, my dear boy. I'll be a sitting duck in there. You hope he dies? I don't think he does. I I don't know though. Why would these outlaws even welcome the wagon in? Come on in, come on in. Welcome to my humble abode. <laughs> come on. <laughs> yeah. Greetings, my good men. <laughs> what would you say if I said immortality was at hand? What would you say if I told you I could teach you to fly? <laughs> what would you say if I told you I could turn a man into a beautiful woman? <laughs> Impossible, yes, once, but no more. Gentlemen, I bring you wisdom from the East. I have here in this wagon some of the finest goods, uh -oh. the best medicines, and the newest inventions available for you and your families. Exotic trinkets from the far reaches of the earth, elixirs that give vigor and strength. <laughs> you can turn a man into Bowsette. <laughs> athletic physique. This miraculous elixir can keep the muscles supple and relax the cords it loosens the joints and gives a feeling of vigor and freshness to the whole system why some men have reported to me that after drinking it for one month they can chew through steel <laughs> what the hell it's a trap yeah. oh shit let me shoot him Shoot! Oh, Fucking tear him up! Oh, Holy shit! shit. Oh, 
Oh god. Oh god. <laughs> I think that guy's dead. Oh, there's more coming. Die. I'll turn them all in the mist. The red mist. <laughs> Alright, this game is way harder without the auto-aim. It's also way more fun. Okay. From 0 to 100. <laughs> Uh, let's see. We're gonna use the volcanic pistol for a little while. There's also like a shitload of ammo and stuff. I think my work here is done. Godspeed, gentlemen. I bid you Oh, he's just leaving. <laughs> Damn, son. Erect. Wrecked. Uh. Ow, ow, ow. Why don't you guys get out of the fucking way? I'm trying to shoot them. You're running in front of me. <laughs> Assholes. Oh, shit. Oh, God. I'm a little- I've got- dude, I've got bloody wings on my back. <laughs> oh god. I don't know where he is- oh, there he is. Hang on. No mames. Is that a good guy or- I think that's a good guy, actually. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's a good guy. I think I just hurt myself. That guy had five dollars. Shit. Follow me, Marston. That's the last of them. We still can't find Williamson anywhere. Hey, it's the snake oil guy. Geraldine, let me in for goodness' sake. That fool must be hiding. Man, it is time to start tearing this place apart and find out where he's cowering! You got sense of urgency here, please? Open the gate! It's the snake oil guy! What Get the, the goddamn hell? gate open and lock it behind him! Oh, we've got company, gentlemen! These scoundrels have got reinforcements riding this way! Oh my good lord above! There must be a hundred of them! A hundred? That seems excessive. That seems like way more than there should be. That looks more like seven than a hundred. Oh, well. Holy shit. What is shooting me? Oh god! <laughs> I think I remember this scene from The Last Samurai. I think. <laughs> yeah, didn't this happen in The Last Samurai? It is murder in time. Oh shit. Uh, 
I like how I just never run out of ammo. <laughs> Mr. Marston, we got a live one. He says, Bill's already run off to Mexico yesterday morning. <laughs> oh, shit. Forget him. Javier Escuela. He's gone to see Javier Escuela. That should make things interesting. Where in Mexico? How should I know? Oh! <laughs> Where in Mexico, you little shit? We're going to Mexico. <laughs> Some place near Chuparos. I think he said. <laughs> Bandit country. Chupa feckin' Rosa. Oh, I'll take you there, John. I'm real popular down there. You just meet me at the ferry. I've got lots of friends down south. I'll see you at the ferry, Irish. I'll just get me things. I'm sorry about this, John. I guess you'll be heading to Mexico. So it would seem. How is it down there? Wonderful. A sweet, peace-loving people with the love of social justice. May you always find coin in your pocket. It's been a pleasure spending time with you, boy. You too, Mr. West Dickens. Marshal. All right, boys. That's enough. Spring breaks come early. I'm gonna, I'm gonna miss all my friends. The empanadas are to die for, right? Is that fucking thunder? I think that, oh, I think that might be thunder. Hope we don't lose power. <laughs> We're going to Cabo. You recognize that suit? Hey, I got $50. Fuck yeah, man. All right, we're going to Mexico, boys. Viva, andale. Let's fucking go. I'm rich, right? Dude, all right, $50 in 1911. How much is that? That's a shitload of money, is it not? If you didn't lose power in a hurricane, you're fine. There wasn't much thunder or lightning during the hurricane, though. Like a million? It was a lot of money. That was a lot. Oh, dude, I, I just tried to ride down this cliff. <laughs> Like 1250 there, there's uh somebody i think it was yesterday we were talking about it and somebody was uh they had a cal like a website that calculated due to inflation how much was it that was that was uh that was really cool i haven't died to gravity all game that'll probably change at some point The game doesn't really let you die to it. <laughs> it like, it really doesn't let you. What the fuck is this shit, man? Why don't you fuck off, dogs? <laughs> Dude, nature, nature fears me so much. Google says twelve, $1,260. That's a lot of fucking money, bro. That is a lot of money. You looked it up. Oh, why am I going this way? I gotta go towards the eye. I'm going like the wrong way. I ran off the train tracks and died. So, oh wait, did, did I die to? Oh yeah, you're right. You're right. I did die to gravity, didn't I? You know, the the environments might be empty, and they definitely kind of are. They're filled with like animals and shit. It doesn't. F feel empty though like it looks it looks gorgeous like if you're gonna talk about like a wilderness and a video game setting like i'd prefer this over breath of the wild that's for sure i feel like this is way more interesting than, than just to look at mexico's south well we're not going south we're going to irish because we're going to a ferry more Korok seeds. There was there were some areas of Breath of the Wild that were super interesting, but not a lot. Let's go. Fallout 3 Wasteland. I don't really care for Fallout that much. I really don't. 
That's kind of why I always kind of held back slightly on Fallout 4. At some point, I will play Fallout 4, but I don't know when. Uh, Zethan, thank you so much for the five months. Appreciate it. Thank you, Zethan. I appreciate that. Let's go. Don't play Fallout 4. How am I going to pass through customs? Yeah, like, how did the... Was, was there any border presence or patrol or, like, anything... In, in these days, could you like freely pass the border, or like how did that even work in in like the early 1900s? There must have been something at least at like the major like thoroughfares and shit, right? Do you think I'd hate Fallout 4? I don't know. There still isn't. Well, I mean, I, I think I think that there is at at certain parts. You know, I mean, what the shit? Go to the treasure hunter. You, you better fucking... I was promised a treasure. You better fucking have a treasure. A treasure map? He gave me... A, wait, wait, isn't that my horse? <laughs> Damn it, he got away. I was gonna... I was gonna carry him off the cliff. Oh shit! Retreat! Retreat! Oh, at 100%, absolutely, I'm gonna play the Resident Evil 2 uh, re remake when it comes out. I was gonna throw his ass off the cliff. I don't know if it'll be like immediate or like. I don't even know when it's coming out. Uh, what, what's the release date for Resident, the Resident Evil 2 remake? Do you know? Right, right. January? Okay. Yeah, I mean, it might not be, like, the exact release date, but it'll be close enough. The 5th of Yo Mama. You want to play that so badly? I really want to play, uh, I don't, Sekiro? Sekiro I really want to play, and, uh, when does Ghost of Tsushima come out? Anybody know on that one? Because that one looks pretty awesome to me as well. Am I even remotely fucking close to this thing? Um... You guys think I could, like, survive going down this cliff? <laughs> I don't think so. Jump. Oh, there's no release date. Oh, so that's gonna be, that's gonna be quite a while. Well, in the meantime, I'm excited for Red Dead 2. Uh, I'm very excited for that. I gotta buy it on PlayStation because I guess, I guess Pooh is also gonna buy it on PlayStation. So maybe we'll do some multiplayer or something like that. So I'm gonna buy it for PlayStation. Uh, yeah. Yeah, it is, it is a nice view, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I really want to play the, the Three Kingdoms Total War as well, too. That's good. That's not till spring, though, I think. Let's go. I've been meaning to get back into Total War on stream, for sure. Lu Boo. Do not pursue Lu Boo. What's up, Braxis? How you doing? Howdy, partner. Yeah. Welcome to my stream. <laughs> Which sort of war is my favorite? Uh, I'd have to go with uh, probably Shogun 2. I love Shogun 2. I don't even know how many fucking hours I have on there. All right, listen, wizard. Listen, listen. I gotta, I, I gotta time you out for that. <laughs> Just for a second here. We don't talk about that, all right? Irish here is well connected south of the border. Oh, it's true. Uh, they love me down there. It's like a second home. I've got more friends than you could shake a stick at, should you so desire. So you know the way. 
Castle assaults. Get on me raft here and let the current sweep us away to paradise. Come on then, Dobby. I'm not sure your idea of paradise and mine are quite the same, Irish. Relax, we'll have a great time and we'll find your man Williamson no bother. I hope so. Hey, come on now. Look at it this way. I know we ain't exactly old pals, but you know, have ever done you wrong? No. But not through lack of trying. Hey! Well, you boys have fun down there. I shall miss you, John Marston. Thank you. Where are you headed? Oh, me? Oh, um, London or Paris or, uh, or maybe Peking. I'm a traveling man, sir. This land is much too small for the likes of me. <laughs> well, try not to get yourself killed. Oh, well, yes, we men of science are not a very loved bunch in this land of myth and superstition. I'm off to the civilized world where men like myself are revered and given medals. Ha! Hmm. Have fun. The same to you, sir. The same to you. <laughs> Suit makes him look like an asshole. It doesn't fit him at all. Who, my character? I want the uh, poncho or something. I wanted the bad guys thing, too. Nice of you to turn up for once, Irish. What do you mean? This water looks really I wanna go swimming, dude. Look at this water. <laughs> can I like shoot? Oh you can shoot the water. Dude, you can shoot the rope? I didn't know you could do that. <laughs> I didn't know you could do that. Uh Marty, thank you so much. In usual fashion, you conveniently missed all the action of Fort Didn't know you could do that. That's a new one. Uh, thank you, Marty. No other cosplays for me. Ooh, a Springfield? Ooh, I got a Springfield. <laughs> Were you saying one dollar is, is 100 bits? was worth $26 back in the day, is that what you're saying? That's crazy. What? This gun is sick. That guy got shot right in the face. <laughs> Alright, I kind of feel a little bad about that one. <laughs> I feel a tiny bit bad about that one. I didn't need to I didn't need to shoot the horse. This rifle is sick. I love this rifle. A horse equals Yoshi? Uh, not quite. Okay, that time I had to do that. <laughs> yeah, you're right, that wouldn't be too shabby. Oh shit! Fucking throwing bombs! <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> the hell was that? Just for the record, if you're playing this game, play it on expert shooting mode. It's way more satisfying to play it on the, shoot the expert mode. I should have done this from the start. This ain't exactly the reception I was expecting. They're not ones to forgive and forget, these fellas. I would say that the aiming is kind of not super fluid. Because it's like designed to be the auto aim. Somebody just fall in the water over there? I think so. Oh god, no, 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 no. 
Get down. How cheap a two bit whore is. <laughs> Was that the horse? Did the horse just go in the water? <laughs> Is that what that was? Ow, 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 ow. Go, go, go. There's like nowhere to hide. This isn't a place to hide. There's like no place to hide here. I'm also like completely out of ammo. That was a good fucking shot, bro. I thought you said they loved you over here. They do. At least the lassies do. Oh, the big brown eyes. Turn stone into butter, they would. Hey, the Mexicans know how to make a bottle of liquor, too. What, that porky? <laughs> now, there's a drink as would take the frost out of a frosty morning. Oh, you're gonna have some fun. There's no place to hide on the raft, right? Well, I'm glad to be back. This place is a wild devil's paradise. Apart from the fellas trying to kill you. Down here, they call me El Rato, the cat. On account of me stealth and cunning. El Rato. Rato means rat, my friend. <laughs> I like it though. A little more inventive than Irish. Well, you Americans never were very creative with your use of language, was you, <laughs> Are there whores in this game? Unfortunately, I don't think that there are. Shite! There's more fools behind that rock! Shit! I didn't know how you could do this. <laughs> that is not how you use a gun, for the record. Oh god, the grenades! They're throwing grenades! It's like when you have auto aim, the game is just not interesting. When you actually do have, when you actually have to aim, it's like way more interesting. This should be a fair fight if you can shoot straight. Rat is Rata in Spanish. Well, maybe Rata is the female version. Uh, yo, M Guerra, thank you so much. Kill the gringo. <laughs> uh, thank you, M. I appreciate that reset. Do I have... I, I'm almost out of ammo. I think we have to switch to the other guns. We'll use the Winchester for a little while. Yeah, exactly. Uh, Tangang, thank you for continuing the gift sub. I appreciate that. Thank you, Tangang. Oh, shit. Dude, I got him! <laughs> so much fear. I told you they me in that <gasps> Dude, I'm gonna fucking die here. Oh my god, dude! There was like... I can't take cover. I can't kill them fast enough. Fucking A, man. I sure hope I got a checkpoint. Uh, Mrs... Or, excuse me, Mr... M Mrs. Parasite. Excuse me. Thank you, Mrs. Parasite. I almost just ran off. On the clip to your left, more the bastard. Oh, how do you? I I couldn't remember how to get out, get under cover. Do they like never miss? Holy crap! So much for your connection, 
Switch guns. <laughs> oh shit! Jesus Christ! Fuck me, man. <laughs> Those people were drunk. I just got fucking annihilated. I wonder if in uh, I wonder if in Red Dead Two if they're gonna bring back the auto aim bullshit because I I I prefer this so much more. Paul! <laughs> Fun and interactive explosions. Are there more? Okay. Resident Evil 4 music? Go Winchester. I doubt you remember any of it, Irish. There's a beach coming up on the left. Hang on, we'll be on dry land soon. Oh, good thing there's horses waiting for us randomly. Oh god. Oh god, no. Oh god. Okay, good enough. I didn't I didn't think there were gonna be more. Did not think there were gonna be more. Look fresher <laughs> Whoop! and healthy. <laughs> Before you degrade <laughs> these poor fools any further, tell me where I'm headed. Of course, of course. Let me think. You do know people down here, aside from Vod Mute. Friends who welcomed us on the way. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he grabbed the horse's Bro, dick. Here, John. You know how it is. Yeah, he touched it. I, I, he's a, he's he appreciates horse cock. What can we so say? <laughs> Chuparosa, funny guy. <laughs> uh, or was that Canada? No, that was Canada. Guy here, not funny, but he's real nice. Uh, failing that, you could try the provincial governor, uh, Colonel something or other, some Spanish name. He's based out of Escalera. Uh, played three card stud with him. He's from Braveheart. Or was it four card Monty? I forget. I, he was a real nice chap. Or maybe he was a real bastard. <laughs> I was real drunk last time, John. <laughs> well, thanks a lot for your help. Oh, let me guess. You gotta be on your way. <sighs> the famed hospitality isn't what it once was. And I've never been known to overstay me welcome. <laughs> so off I go to greener pastures. Good luck, John. You're an angry and a feck ugly man. <laughs> Not a bad one. <laughs> He's continuously smelling farts. Yeah, I can see that. Hey, I got some fame from all that. Uh, let's see. Do I do I get do I have to get Mexican money? Do I get pesos? Or do the Mexicans not have any money? Nope, just American dollars. I guess that would be too complicated if you had to do an exchange rate, right? Dinero is good here. Yes, it is. Well, we are in Mexico. I can go visit Valdio and, and uh, Shiny Garnet. <laughs> All money was the same.
You still have to catch a donkey show? Yeah, TMR, right? New DLC trumps wall. Oh my god. <laughs> Quickie 2 beta cartridge. Uh, I finished Halo 1, 2, and 3 on Legendary. I, have, I haven't played uh, ODST yet. ODST will happen next. I don't know when. Ill-fitting cowboy hat. This hat fits me quite well. Thank you very much. It's a little tight, but I, I, ha I do have a very large head. <laughs> That's why I don't wear hats, because ha uh, hats don't fit my head. Head is too fucking big. Mocking the hat should be bannable offense. I mean, I was trying to stay on the road here. So if I, if I commit crimes in Mexico, do the federales come after me or what's up? What's up, Angelos? An anthropologist hat. Shadow ban the non believers. Yeah. Am I going this way? Oh, this is the border, the border crossing, leaving Mexico. I think we're still going this way. Yeah, this is Red Dead Redemption. Pancho Villa is going to come for me. So am I going to LR or am I going to D? I'm not sure which one. I'm your new after school cartoons. <laughs> uh, I don't really care. I think I've, uh, I think I played this game a long time ago and I think that happened last time I did it. I like vaguely remember, so. I'm not gonna go out of my way. I do have the I do have the undead nightmare whatever I will not be playing it though. I guess I'm going towards the D. Play it on your end. There you go. I don't really care for the whole zombie thing. I didn't really didn't really do it for me. It was fun for a little while, but meh. Whee! Is there a map? Uh, you can see on the bottom left is a map. I'm uh, riding towards the D, and I think that's right. What kind of miles per gallon does this car get? <laughs> There must be like an equivalent for horses, right? Like how many miles do you get off a horse per like bales of hay or something? <laughs> I gotta get the I gotta get to the big D, exactly. Twenty six miles per bale of hay. Um, we should be close, right? There's a house. 12 oats to the mile. <laughs> Furlongs to the forest. Yeah, these all sound right to me. Hang on. Can I buy this, like, little shed here? $150. I'm gonna buy, I'm gonna buy, this is gonna be my paradise. I got the Mexican poncho entry. Wait, can I wear a poncho now? Oh! <gasps> Hang on, hang on, hang on. Hey, hey, yo, we're fucking. We are one hundred percent fucking Clint Eastwood now. Big spending. Oh, who cares? This is all you need for like the rest of the game, bro. It's high noon. <laughs> 
That's all you need, man. Alright, let's save the game real fast. Yeah, now it's fucking legit. Absolutely. I need a real life poncho now. Alright, the D is up here somewhere. The IRL poncho. Where? Oh, dude, that motherfucker's gone already. Get, leave me alone. He is already gone. Just throw a shower curtain over my shoulder. <laughs> what do you want, Gringo? What are you doing here? Have you heard? There's a war going on. My name's John Marston. I've been sent here to retrieve a couple of men. Can I speak to your commander? You want to talk to my boss, Gringo? I guess. Because I'm not good enough for you? No, sir. You think you're better than me? You come to my country, my poor little country, and you think you can be friends with the president? No, sir. I'm sorry, sir. Things must have come out wrong. Maybe you can help me. You'll be sorry, friend. <laughs> relax, I mean, relax. <laughs> uh, how are you? Sure. Al Pacino. Somewhere between a threatening stare and the soldier's arm to the teeth. Yeah. Yeah, you had me. Welcome to Mexico, amigo. Hey. <laughs> and then we'll talk. My name is Capitan Vicente de Santa. John Marsh. Tuco. <laughs> My country is in pain. John Master, terrible pain. My name is Jeff. No politician, sir. And I am uh, no soldier, Aquila. Mm -hmm. But we are both beholding to our time. A brave man. Perhaps you've heard of him, Coronel Alande. He's trying to preserve the order in our province. To keep oh, the civilization alive, it is tough. The people are confused. Sounds like Cheech. Sometimes in the service of what is right, you gotta do terrible things. <laughs> it breaks my heart. I also am no moralist, sir. I wish I enjoy your freedoms, Mr. Marston. I'm trying to find a man, an American, an outlaw named Bill Williamson. I believe he came here to seek protection from another outlaw named Javier Escuela. You're no moralist, but you hunt outlaws? So it would seem. You heard anything of these men? I am the government, or what is left of it. Outlaws seek each other. They're possibly hiding with thieves and killers. Those <laughs> as freedom fighters in the hills around here. They're united under one traitor named Abraham Reyes. Where could I find this Reyes? If I knew, I would be there. Hunting him with everything that is true within me. Reyes finds you. Like cholera. <laughs> <laughs> Something like that. But it's possible, though. My men are trying to lure him into a trap. Possibly you could ride with us. And if everything goes okay, I'm sure the coronel will help you. Okay. Vámonos! You can All right. Ride, or ride on the wagon. Uh, take your own horse, do I? Oh, I do have a horse. Uh, I guess I'll ride my own horse. I don't really want to sit on a wagon. Dude, my poncho is Liddy. You're looking for the Zatarans? <laughs> Whoops, sorry. <laughs> I didn't know what 
to expect. I hadn't even crossed the border and I was being shot at. You will hear a lot of words like tyrant and oppression here. Words that the peasants have been taught, but do not understand meaningless words. The army is suffering uh, a crisis of reputation. Even I've heard about the colonel down here. He's not famous for his compassion. This is the point. Have you met Coronel? Like Out of my way, amigo. <laughs> He just repeat lies you heard. Baby. Allende is a good man, a strong man. He carries the weight of a million problems on his shoulders. Am I supposed to pity him? You gringos are so quick to judge. You love to talk badly of other people because it makes you feel better about yourselves. Maybe you should look in the mirror. You're the one talking about this. And I ain't here to make judgment on the way of your government. I've got enough problems with my own right now. This isn't America, senor master. We are poor. Kindness must take a different form. What is better? To pull your arm around a hungry man or to beat him until he grows some food to eat? I think you need to answer that question yourself. I always hated the dialogue traveling in Rockstar games. This game is full of it. Like, every mission is like go from point A to point B and a shitload of talking in between those parts and then like a short shootout that's really fun and then right back to more talking. Part of the past I can't seem to get rid of. Honestly, like at some point I'd rather they just be cutscenes, you know. Like I'm not really doing anything right now. I'm, I'm holding A and I'm just like occasionally tapping left or right. Like that's it. I know I can't change the past. This isn't this is not super interesting for me. Never helped you sleep at night, amigo. My country is full of American criminals, mostly in the service of the rebel peaks. Mexico is an easy place for men to lose himself. Whether he wants to get lost or not. Hopefully not too easy. I ain't got much time to find these. Why can't they have auto ride? Well they kinda do, you just hold A, right? The highest price. Can I ask how much? I'm not getting paid. It's it's a long story. I'm being made to do this. I will never understand you Americans. Me neither. We have a system of law in Mexico, senor. We do not tolerate people who think they can run with their own Shoot one of them? I it doesn't you can't do that. I just failed the mission have to do it all over again. Dialogue during shootouts or something? Well then that would be just like chaotic, I don't know. This is just how they mostly give you the story in the game, you know? The right. Don't you throw silly ideas at me. What do you know about the rights of the Mexican people? Very little. Just saying, there must be something behind this rebellion. I'll tell you what's behind there, Senor Marston. Lies. Insidious lies. Exposition trail, yeah. My guy's talking. It only takes a few men to move many. Maybe they've just had enough of being called stupid. You're talking about things you don't understand. If you ask me something, I'm gonna give you an answer. Are you a revolutionary? Is that why you're here? I was once, I suppose. In a twisted kind of way, I thought I could change something if I fought hard enough. Change what? I don't know. Maybe that was the problem. Revolution is always selfish. It is nothing but greed and ego. Individuals put in their own needs above those of others. It is people fighting for change when they have no idea what change is. If you're a poor man who's been beat down all his life, any change is going to seem good. What? You think that overthrowing the government is going to make a poor man rich? If you're not helping them, it's only... You didn't get enough hat comments, here you are. Go ahead, hit me with them. revolutionary, <laughs> you are very naive. What do you want us to do? Walk around giving out money to every poor person in Mexico? <laughs> what a terrible idea. First, they need to look at why they're poor. Then they need to go out and do some work rather than sitting on their culos talking about freedom. This is a long fucking ride here. The leader of the rebels? Bram Reyes? He's a traitor. A liar. A coward and a sinner. A hero who has done nothing. I have far more respect for the shit I looked this morning than I ever will for that pathetic war. That's a nice image. Barb had him out when? A man born in a golden cradle who pretends to fight for the poor. He's taking advantage of the ignorant and the weak. A checkpoint along this road? They're not going to make you redo this. Of course he is. All that bastard does is stand in a balcon, giving speeches. But it's easy to make promises you can never keep. It takes more than a few promises to build an army. Reyes wants power, nothing else. He doesn't care about anybody but himself. He's prepared <laughs> Imagine the ride back. Yeah, I'm gonna have to. <laughs> Excuse me. 
It's not far now. Are you ready? Ready for what? We will lure the rebels into our trap. There's a train leaving to Parosa soon. We're going to escort it. They will think it's a supply train. No <laughs> one hell of a GPS. Very clever. We must throw the rats out of their holes. Give them some bait they can refuse. Wrong direction, turn around. <laughs> We're going on a train? Oh. What what? Oh. My bad. Come on! Vamanos! Follow the Santa to the train. Alright, I'm following Santa. <laughs> Let's go, Santa Claus. There is a train. We must escort it to Casa Madrugada. Escort the train. That's the Santa. <laughs> De Santa. De Santa. Believe it or not, I I know how to. My my Spanish isn't too bad. Calling him Santa Claus is a little is tongue in cheek. <laughs> uh, what's the gun I want to use here? Because I know we're gonna get attacked. I guess we'll go with this one. Yo, Uncle Sam, thank you so much for three months. Thank you, Uncle Sam. Let's go. Oh shit. Oh god, they're on the other side. Wrecked. I mean, I want to stay with the train engine, right? Oh shit. Well, oh, these are all bad guys. Oh god, oh god, ow, go, goodbye, goodbye, goodbye. I'm sorry. <laughs> well, they're not really doing any damage to the train yet, so that's good. Bye, horsey. Do you think it's gonna live up to the hype? I mean, it looks awesome. It's always, it's always. I, I don't like judging games before I even get a chance to play them. But uh, that's gonna be awesome. Oh, that's a friend. I was shooting a friend. Donde esta la biblioteca? <laughs> no Man's Sky looked awesome. Look out! More oh shit! Oh god, I think I might be dead. There's my horse. Oh, oh, what's going on? Take this guy's horse. Quick. Go, get out. Holy shit. They just fucking left me to die. Oh, dude, the train's not doing so good. Oh shit. Oh shit, dude. This isn't even my fucking horse. Okay. I'm trying to keep up. 
<laughs> Thank you for the bits. Oh god. I think I got him? No, I didn't. Oh shit, were we successful? Damn, dude, that got really close right at the end. I'm gonna have to go get my actual horse now. <laughs> Tram engine? You did a good thing for Mexico today. Coronel Allende will be very pleased. All right. We did it. Oh shit. Cut off? What? Marston, you're gonna have to do something. What? You have to go out there and start that train before it crosses the bridge. Todavía levántese. Usted también. Y allá atrás, muévase. ¿Qué le pasa a usted? Ay, Dios mío, levántese. Ya mismo. Mount a horse. Is this my horse? I guess so. Take out the rebels to retake the train. Oh shit! They fucking took the train. Can you get on the train? Hang on. Hang on, can I jump on the train? Hold up. I know I want to get on the train. How do you, I don't know how you get off. That's not how you get off! Fuck! I don't know how to get off. I want to get on the train. <laughs> I don't know how you get off. I guess we're not getting off. These angles I have to shoot at. Get alongside and jump onto it. Okay. Spanish words intensify. Maybe I have to do it like right here. Oh. Hoi! Oh shit, there was fucking dynamite. Holy shit. Woo. Damn, son. Get shot in Spanish. <laughs> Dude, I heard about that, Kiavik. I heard about that. Did not reach 88 miles per hour. That was cool. I like that mission. Hey, I got 50 more dollars! Getting more famous. Horace was unable to find me. Oh shit. Oh, here it comes. I really like the Springfield. I really like that one. To buy a house with that money? I already bought it. I bought a house in Mexico for $150. It came with a free poncho. Really, I bought a poncho for $150, but that's fine. They're just bootleg Yoshis. I'll be loaded. Whoa, 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 what was that? Somebody was like trying to talk to me here? Except challenge? Kill three birds before the time runs out. Oh shit. Hey, thanks for the money, idiot.
Appreciate it. <laughs> what am I doing Halo 4? Uh, it would be after ODST and Reach. Didn't even loot him? I don't care. I didn't kill him for the money, I killed him for fun. <laughs> I know, dude, you can't get rid of your armor. You can't get rid of it. Or your your honor, not your armor. You can't be a bad guy in this game. It doesn't work. It would be so annoying to, play, to actually try to play as a bad guy in this game. Everything you do, it's like plus 300 honor. It would just be agony. I like occasionally just doing something stupidly evil. You know, that's 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 how Barb get down gets down. <laughs> I think I have to. So I'm heading towards the LR or the D. I was establishing dominance. Let's go. Chaotic neutral. I want. You know what I want? I uh, I want somebody to make one of those sheets where it's like. Good lawful, good neutral, good chaotic. I want somebody to do one of those of like streamers in the Mario community. That's I want I want I want people to do those. I feel like three cats would have to be chaotic evil. <laughs> and Carl maybe would be chaotic good, I would say. Pooh could be good neutral, I think. Good lawful would have to be like Dragon Feeny or something. Pooh is lawful good. No, nah, I don't think Pooh is lawful good. Or yeah, Aura is definitely true neutral. <laughs> I agree. <laughs> he even looks like the dudes from uh, from Futurama, who are like, <laughs> if you see my wife, tell her I said hello. <laughs> I want. I, I just. I want that sheet filled out. <laughs> you th no, three cats has got to be chaotic evil. It's got to be. You think I'm lawful neutral? Really? I just want to see. I just want to see the sheets. I think it would be really funny. Put a scarf on to avoid getting a bad reputation. I don't know. Let's go. What's all that? I don't know. I don't know. Yeah. Maybe a uh, neutral, chaotic neutral, or something. Uh, Dode could be another lawful good. For sure. I'd say Dode or Feeny would be lawful good. I don't know what I am. I'm I'll leave that to fucking you guys to decide. I don't care. <laughs> yeah, Dode, Dode, Dode literally has a PG emote. He's literally got one. Start a straw poll. Chuparosa. Okay. Oh, we got the. Is this the LR? What? Oh, it just started a new mission. Okay. Darbian. Oh, I haven't seen. I haven't seen Darbian in a while. Uh, yo, Chris Cross. Thank you for the 14 months. Thank you, Chris Cross. No, sir. Pardon, pero yo habla un solo poquito español. <laughs> habla English? <laughs> oh, sí, gringo. Hablo mucho inglés. Sí. Hablo filthy fucking bean eater. Hablo slippery little Mexican. <laughs> Hablo little piece of shit. Shit. <laughs> Comprende, amigo? Comprende? <laughs> What are you doing here, gringo? I don't remember inviting you to my country. I don't think you did, amigo. I mean you no harm. <laughs> <laughs> you mean us no harm? This is funny. <laughs> what yep, we just got down to Mexico a little while ago. Us. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing, amigo. 
Now, I appreciate the welcome committee, but I'd hate to spoil a beautiful afternoon on such beautiful land, any further unpleasantries. Now, if you'll excuse me. Uh, holy gringo, I think you're forgetting something. A little taxation. <laughs> I have a large family. <laughs> I too have a family friend. So that we may see our families again, I suggest we part ways amicably. <laughs> can I see the boots, gringo? I think you can see them from where you're standing just fine, senor. Take off the boots, Americano. Can I just shoot them and be done with this? There we go. Oh, very good. Very good indeed, sir. What a great way to improve border relations. An illiterate farmer crossing the river, coming into their civilization and butchering the local peasants. <laughs> Thank you very much, sir. Don't mention it, old man. You kill peasants, you become a peasant. I never aspired to be anything more. <laughs> a socialist, huh? No wonder you left America. I'm many things, most of them bad. But a man of political principles? No. Well, then I fear Mexico may not be for you, sir. Don't you worry about me. Oh, but I do worry. An angry man a long way from home, a man who handles a gun as sloppy as you. I can handle a gun okay, partner. Yeah, as long as you're killing quail or peasants. But if you have to face another man, you don't stand a chance. And you do? I can show you a few tricks. Come with me. Hold on. What's your name? <laughs> that doesn't matter anymore. And you? I never had a name, mister. I was raised in an orphanage. <laughs> Real American, huh? Wonderful. Just wonderful. Okay. <laughs> the duel with Charles Bronson and Henry Fonda. Well, you won't make it the circus, but you can shoot. Keep on practicing. Thank you, old man. Now, who are you? No one interesting. Who are you? Landon Ricketts. Not a name that means much anymore. Is it Sam Elliott? I don't know. You were famous when I was a boy. Yeah, killing men's a strange kind of fame. I was the fastest in my time. I must have been. I'm the only Yo. One what are you doing here? Well, it's our sub baby. Living bars. quietly. Revolver Ocelot's great grandfather. <laughs> what? Let's go on. Uh, Jacoby, thank you for the nine months. And you? I'm looking for a couple of men. Bill Williamson, Javier Escuela. Escuela's from here. It could be. This whole place is teaming with... Shala Shaska! Americans on the run. Mercenaries, locals hell-bent on revolution. So what the fuck happened revolution. in Metal Gear Solid? Did Liquid Snake, like, really infect... Is. Revolver Ocelot or some shit? I don't even I don't even know, dude. Or like Revolver Ocelot has Liquid Snake's arm or something? Is that what it is? I forget. I have no idea. Local government. Foul bunch. Colonel Dude, Metal Gear Solid is like the fucking most if you've ever fought like I've I don't even know the story of Metal Gear Solid. The story of that game is fucking insanity. It's insanity. Someone puts a bullet in his head. Come on, let's get back to it. You gotta keep that it took Liquid's straight. arm to replace the arm of Overlost to the Cybernet Ninja that helped you in the first game. So it's part. So the arm is Liquid's. I've got a Showfield revolver. Well done. Now that wasn't so hard, was it? Okay. Follow me. 
We're gonna try something a little he hypnotized himself to think he was liquid still in Metal Gear Solid 4. I say we put your newfound skills to the test. Metal Gear. Service for the good people of Chuparosa. Here we'll do. I'm gonna scare up some birds. Let's see if you can take down more than one at a time. How many birds do you want me to kill? Nicely done, sir. You've been taught well. We we didn't teach me anything. Why? Why am I shooting? Like I've gotten this far in the game. You think I can shoot some fucking birds? I heard many a story when I was a boy. Still do sometimes. What these days? I find that hard to believe. What do people say? Oh, you know how them conversations go. Fellers arguing over who's Sorry, sorry. <laughs> Jeez, man. <laughs> that dude was mad. He was fucking ready. Senor Ricketts! Senor Ricketts! Senor Ricketts! Por favor, senor! Our back wagon's under attack just outside of town. We need your help again. Whoa, slow down, Ramon. We'll take care of it. Thank you, senor. Again, you are the savior of this town. Well, my friend, are you ready to take a less theoretical exam? Sure. I don't think I ever rode with no savior before. <laughs> Let's haul out. Time we put you to work on some bigger prey. Which horse is uh, mine? Is it this one? I guess it's this one. All, all the horses are identical. Yeah. Okay. More riding and following. So why are you looking for Thank you, Soup. Man? It's a long story. We used to ride together. We was all friends once. Only a buzzard feeds on his friends. There must be a high bounty on their heads. What would you do if somebody took the people you love and told you they'd die if you didn't do as they asked? There they are. Follow me. Keep your distance and use Deadeye to take out the captor. What? Who's next? You really want to die? I guess we're good. Alright, let's move out. Everybody Okay. Get a bird while I'm at it. I guess I could, right? Escort the wagon. I can see you haven't lost your touch, Landon. Nobody said I had. You talk real big for a boy who couldn't shoot straight a half hour ago. What the hell is this guy talking about? Old man who can't stand up straight no more. You're a long way from being a Landon Ricketts partner. Young, old, or otherwise. All those stories you heard as a boy were true, you know. Oh, shit. Yeah, shooting people is way more fun than shooting birds. Oh, I wanted to lasso him. Oh, he's alive. <laughs> Can I? Hang on. One sec. One sec. <laughs> I did get a poncho. Return to the wagon, my ass. I caught a I caught a bad guy. What do I do with the bad guy? <laughs> All right. <laughs> so cute. <laughs> no, no, no. Hang on. <laughs> oh, come on. So cute. Um, bye, bye. <laughs> <laughs> that was a bad guy. Don't feel bad for the bad guy. <laughs> Criminal mind. 
Nunca podré agradecer lo suficiente. Buy me a whiskey later. We'll call things about you. <laughs> Good thing games don't cause violence. <laughs> that was that was 100% a bad guy. All right. Hey, we're more famous. Hey, I got some honor back. That was a bad guy. I, I'm if you listen, if you treat one bad guy horribly, then the ne next time people will think twice about becoming a bad guy. Look, I, I'm just doing the most humane thing possible. If we kill them too quickly, we have to make an example out of them. To discourage future bad guys. That's how justice works. Sound logic? Exactly! So really, tying that guy up and throwing him off the cliff was the most merciful thing I could do. <laughs> oh my god, what the fuck was that?! There was a guy on a donkey?! <laughs> Did anybody fucking see that? I didn't see shit at all. <laughs> I didn't see that guy at all, where he just came out of fuck- that was- that wasn't even me trying to be evil, that was just a fucking accident. <laughs> exactly. I'm I'm like Thanos. <laughs> Thanos was the good guy, right? I think Thanos would be lawful evil, right? Pretty sure. Thanos did nothing wrong. Like, he's not doing things for just random reasons, right? That would make him the protagonist. Yo, what's up, freaking ah? Just all the evils? Thanos and Joe. Whoa, shit! I gotta keep my eyes on the road, dude. There's like wagons and donkeys and shit. Alright, we're going back to the D. Thomas Mathis for the first time. <laughs> well, it was Mal it's Malthus, right? Or is it Mathis? I thought it was Malthus. Off to the D. The demon drink. I like that guy's mustache. That's a good mustache. I should start grooming my mustache into that. You are the bounty hunter, huh? I like his widow's peak. I knew I liked this guy. <laughs> Wait, is there is there a resemblance here? Or? Perhaps, but it isn't so. Ah, uh, perhaps I should tie you to a horse and let it drag you around town, or let the dogs fight you, huh? Then see what you say. I'd say the same thing. I'm here to bring two men to justice, nothing more. Your politics or ideas of entertainment are not my concern. Yeah. I should grow that mustache. Well, Kurosaji, if my if my grand if my grandparents are here, they'd be like, "You're not Mexican. You're Spanish." <laughs> so. It's not my no no. Men like that are natural allies for Reyes. My people have lived and worked here for a hundred years. We brought Does my wife have the widow's peak gene? No. These fucking monkeys. My wife has a normal hairline. Her father is like eight, like seventy, like mid seventies or something, and uh, he's got like a full head of hair. Themselves, who saved them from themselves. I see in your faces. 
they will kill me. I think the widow's peak and the hairline dies with me. Because I think it, you get you get that shit from your mother's side, I think, right? Well, sorry to hear that. Sorry? Why be sorry? It is a way of mankind. A fight between two forces. Que sara, sara. What will be, will be. But I know one thing, Senor Marston. Force. Right, right. Force must be used if you are to have your own way. I'm sure. Now, perhaps you can... Uh, do me a favor while I find these men for you. After we find the men, then I'll help in any way I can. Ah, da, 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 da. You are in no position to negotiate. Now, por favor, a bunch of these idiots men are fighting at Tesoro Azul. Now, you head there and you lend your support. Baboso, <sighs> ¿cuántas veces voy a decirte? No ponga detrás de mí. Que era el cabrón. No está mi sombra. Vaya. I sent some men ahead. We will meet them there. This my horse. I I can never tell what my horse is anymore. I don't know anymore. Epic hat heads. If it's your mother's father, she didn't get it from her mom. Well, my grandfather was bald on my mother's side. So my mother my mother's father was bald. So, but my uncle, like, my uncle's not bald, though. And I'm not bald either. I don't know. My men left some time. Not yet, anyway. We're already late. Come on. Let's see if you can write. <laughs> We're racing now? Why are we racing? Your uncle works at Hair Tendo. <laughs> That man was saying really nice, really mean things. Oh, really? Come on. I thought he was saying really nice things. <laughs> Speed run confirmed. Yeah. Why not? It was like Rockstar didn't want to give you more stories. They're so like, here, uh, throw a race in there. Why not? So, okay, so Red Dead Redemption 2, does that take place in like Montana or some shit? I'm not actually sure. Doesn't it t doesn't it take place somewhere else? Let's go. My horse is gonna fucking throw me off. Somewhere in the Rockies. Oh, really? My men are dead. The rebels will all die. When they're alive. They are filming, and the rebels will all die. So I guess we ain't taking any prisoners then. To shoot the other guy? Is it essentially Red Dead Re Revolver? I have no idea. I never played Red Dead Re Revolver. I don't know. Are there Mounties in Red Dead 2? I don't, I don't think, uh, I don't think there are Mounties. Because I don't think it takes place in Canada. <laughs> I don't think so. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. I got shot right away. <laughs> Dude, clear the line of fire. Look at this fucking idiot. Can I get away from these people? Hang on. Climb. Climb over. There we go. Barbly do right. Ah! Up here. Oh shit, oh shit. <laughs> I think that guy's dead. Ooh, let's go double barrel shotgun. Uh, 
This is my boomstick. Okay. Ooh, I can loot the bodies. These guys have like these guys have money. Right. It's four in the morning. Some some nights, man. There are some nights where I just cannot sleep and I'm just like you know if you see me at 4 a.m. Eastern time and I'm in aura stream you just know I'm not sleeping that night that happens pretty often to me this village is riddled with rebels make sure they don't have homes to come back to there are fire bottles over yeah right just retire some of these houses and what makes you think I'd do that you want to find Javier Escuela don't you done you're helping Mexico vamonos muchachos that's all the time for you? Happens, man. Pick up fire bottles? Shit. Wait, where are the fire bottles? Oh, take fire bottles. Hold L3 to pull up the radio menu and bring up the fire bottle. L3? Fire bottle. Are we just so we're just burning the village? Woo! This is fun. Yeehaw! Dude, why can't we burn more more villages? This is great. <laughs> burning villages is sick. They're all really polite and helpful. Yeah, you can't actually fire your gun in Canada. It doesn't work. You need to relax. Come back to the villa and sample some of the new girls before they spoil. Hey, fifty more dollars. We take that. Take those. New items are available to purchase in stores. And I got more famous from that. Dude, I am I am rich as fuck. I'm also like stuck on this body here. Sorry, partner. Hey. All right, so we can head towards the D or we can head towards the LR. What's the LR? Uh, is this my horse? Sure hope so. Uh, I guess we can head towards the D or the LR. I want to go to the LR. I want to see what that's about. Oh, LR is the old guy? Oh, yeah, Landon Ricketts. Yeah, Landon Ricketts. Right, right, right. The bird shooting guy. Uh, I think I have a long walk ahead of me. <laughs> I think I've got a long walk ahead of me. Unless... There we go. Now we're good. <laughs> oh, wait! my That wasn't my horse? Um, my bad. <laughs> my bad. Wait, where's the fucking... Where's the LR? Look at my map. Like, where, where is my map here? Good lord, man. I guess I can go towards Escalera, which is the other direction. If 
I want to head towards Escalera, but my map is like all my things are gone. Comically monstrous behavior. <laughs> I guess we're gonna go this way. I'll just follow the train tracks. Listen, listen. I, I think that what transpired there, that, that could have happened to anybody. That, that could have happened to literally anybody. So, let, let, cut me a little slack here. I thought I needed a horse. And then here comes this guy with a horse. What am I supposed to do? I sure hope there's no train coming behind me or in front of me. Oh, am I fucking- I'm back in- I'm back in America. I just- I just accidentally crossed- I just changed countries here by accident. I went to the wrong fucking country. Whoops. Dude, I thought it was dead! I thought- I- I didn't mean to ride the horse off the cliff. That- that was an accident. But that wasn't even- it turns out that wasn't even my horse. Yeah, a long time ago, I remember um, I was in Valdio stream. I haven't seen Valdio stream in a while, but I, I assume he's just like busy and you know, real life gets in the way and stuff. Uh, but Valdio was saying that like, I think it might have been where he worked or something, that they had like a donation jar, like a tip jar, because Val Valdio is from Mexico, and the tip jar said like, for Trump's wall or something. <laughs> I thought that was pretty funny. I would totally tip in that. <laughs> oh, we don't. We don't want to get. We're just. We're just joking. We don't want to get political. That wasn't an invitation to get political. It was just. It was just a funny don't tip jar. That's all. Let's let's not get political. Whether I agree or disagree, I'll let you guys. You know, judge. I just thought it was funny. What? Return the stolen wagon? Uh, which wagon? This one? Return the wagon to the owner. Okay. There's a number of people on Twitch and like Twitch chats and like the second anybody makes any kind of comment that might be even construed as like slightly political they're like fucking ready they're like the it's like the fuck Trump button they're so ready to hit that I'm a bad man friend Do I get money? Oh, he gave me $17. Okay. That's not bad. Killed the thief. I did find. I finally killed the right person, right? Finally. Kill him and take the rest. There's too many witnesses. I don't feel like dealing with it. All the nut buttons? Yeah, where's the nut buttons? Hey, he gave me $17. That's more than. Usually I get like $3 for, for doing that. He actually gave me a pretty. That's a pretty decent amount. <laughs> nut. The nut button. I can't ride for shit. Iron plate for body armor. Uh, body armor doesn't really help against bullets very much. Usually. Alright. We're going to LR and ended up at D. I know, I know. I got turned around. I don't have a bandana though. There's no time, ride with us. Then we'll find the main you seek. Come. There's a combo waiting for us. Come, no, we must hurry. Yeah. I like the deal. 
falling off a cliff is a bit disorienting, right? <laughs> you know, casual cruelty is the best kind. Ride shotgun, okay. I agree, it never stops being funny. That's the legal defense for killing the, for killing the dude. I fell off a cliff, it happens. <laughs> hey, we get to skip the destination. Why can't we do that more often? Jeez. <sighs> okay. I wonder how much of the game is left. I remember later in the game, you get to like, you go to like the north, right? Am I am I wrong about that? I feel like you're in like a snowy area. Uh, I don't remember though. Oh god. Is that a good guy? I think that must be a good guy. Where is the spring? I want to use the spring field. Is he that deranged captain of Tesora Azul? Is he leading this attack? Kodiak, is that what it is? Follow me. We will lead the wagon here. <laughs> Sniper rifle. Okay. Oh shit. Oh, I see. They're like up on the rocks. Oh shit. Got that guy. Oh, there's another one. <laughs> All right. Oh shit. Sometimes in this game it's hard to tell if you have an angle or not. It's like the white line appears, but it's it's still kinda hard to tell. There was another one. I think he just he just ate it. Yeah, he's, he's he just died. Is there one like up there or something? What do we got? <laughs> oh, is he alive? What the fuck? 
what you was getting into. <laughs> I guess that's one way. All right, back to this. Back to the uh, Springfield here. Knife. Knife. Knife is so rarely the answer. It says there's one more behind this wagon. Hang on. <laughs> Wait. Can I roast them? I'm not getting him. I want to. There we go. I think we got him. <laughs> there we go. Cool party. Let's heat things up a bit. <laughs> I've got my fire mixtape for you. Be careful, it is too hot to handle. <laughs> we need to bring back one liners, dude. Oh shit, that guy just that guy just ate it. Uh okay, hang on. I don't know what I'm aiming for here. I'm just gonna use the pistol. Fall back my ass. What are you talking about? Yo, Lady Kazzy, thank you so much for continuing the gift sub. I appreciate that. Uh, thank you, Lady Kazzy. Holy fuck my butts. I think it's time for the fire bottle. You should have run away. <laughs> I think I got him. <laughs> yeah, I got him. The fire rises. Get all the ammo. It's kind of funny with so many allies, I feel like they don't even target me anymore. Like occasionally I get shot, but even that's pretty rare. The only Rockstar game you actually love. I this game's great. It's so much better when you turn off the auto aim though. I think auto aim just makes this game really stupid. Oh shit. Yeah, we'll kill them all. One sec. I told you I weren't no one nice. Oh shit. I don't even know if I can hit that guy from here. I have played LA Noir. Uh I, I almost thought about getting it again on the Switch. I did not though. Ah, uh, yo! 
Oh, yo, Jilo, thank you so much. Hang on. I need going. Holy fuck, that's a lot of dudes. Dude, like, I'm, what else can I do here? I'm, like, right on him. Why did that work when I aimed to the right a little bit? <laughs> Why did that work? Uh... Oh. Woo! You're cool off. <laughs> Wind speed makes you want to watch Sicario. I've never seen that one. Dude, why? It's like I aim to the right and now I get the, the kills I need. It's so strange. Is he dead? I can't tell. Buy it on PlayStation, what, L.A. Noir? Uh, I'm not super fond of L.A. Noir. I like it, but I don't think it would be a great game to stream. Uh, yo, Meg Mucklebones, thank you so much. Meet DeSanta at Torquemada. I mean, let's face it, you can't Torquemada anything. <laughs> uh, Colin, thank you for 100 bits. <laughs> Appreciate it. Hey, yo. The best pleasures Earth can give a man. <laughs> I need some information, DeSanta. All in good time. <laughs> uh, my man and I will finish our business here, and so we can talk back at Escalera. The next time I see you, I need some answers, Captain. <laughs> go get drunk, go get a woman, enjoy life. It's a beautiful struggle. <laughs> Boo, can you take your sub back after that? Oh, come on. <laughs> What's up, Altstrad? How you doing, man? Night's going good. Playing some Red Dead. They learned cliff killing from me. They maybe, maybe they did. Yeah, no refunds, obviously. Never any refunds. A hundred fucking dollars. Thank you very much. I appreciate that. Uh, is there a place? So all that's left is a land and Ricketts missions, I think. So I have to do those. Hundred fucking pesos. <laughs> it's no longer continuing his gift sub. I bet there's like a shitload of ammo I could pick up here too, right? Hang on. Not that it really matters, but... It doesn't matter, but it does. That's a lot of ammo. Uh, where am I going? Yo. Thank you for 100 bits. Hrafenblad. Thank you very much. That guy had five. I'm stuck in him. I'm stuck inside of him. <laughs> I couldn't get out. Thank you, Hrafenblad. Um, there's like more bodies. I'm way better at pronouncing than poo. <laughs> Raffenblad sounds like something from, um... Well, blood is blood. I don't know what Raffen is. Is that like Middle English or something? I don't, I don't know. Uh, is there like, so there's no place to save. I just literally have to ride out of here, don't I? Oh, uh, I've never, I've never seen, uh, never seen Sicario. Oh, it's Old English? I can still, uh, I learned how to do it in college. I can still do, I think, the first 50 to, uh, it's 50 or 60 lines of uh, Beowulf. I can still do it. Um, before you ask, I'm not going to do it. But I can still do it. <laughs> I haven't done it in a long time, but I can probably, I, I'm pretty sure I can still do it. Great talent. Thanks, man. Whoa. 
Got your hopes up? <laughs> Recite Beowulf for it? I don't know the whole thing. The real panty dropper. When you hit the way Gardena and Yer Dagum. <laughs> uh, Anger MCS, thank you for the six months. I'm doing good. Please, no. How many bits for the Beowulf routine? More than you got, Polywog. <laughs> Sploosh. <laughs> Tell me a bedtime story. For $100, you do not have 100 pesos, Alejandro. I don't want to hear it from you. <laughs> Thank you for the bit. Sweet hat, thanks, man. Uncle Barb's bedtime story. I actually am an uncle. Let's go. Yo, Bic Thaken. Thank you so much for 100 bits. I could go for some Bic Thaken myself. Sounds pretty good. I guess I'm going this way. My wife and I still have some Canadian money lying around. We might like throw it away or something, I don't know. <laughs> if one of us catches a cold, we might need like an extra tissue or something. When I turn sword chat, my my eyes are hidden by the brim of the hat. That that's that's where the real sex appeal comes from. We got like got this going on, and I'm like, "Howdy, partner." Canadian pesos. <laughs> Thank you guys for the bits. Come on, m'lady. <laughs> Bat Barb? That's, uh, that's, what are you talking about? That's Gino. You found those bananas under your bed. Took a break from here to watch my YouTube videos. Worst choice ever. <laughs> yeah, I've been, uh, I've been slightly slacking on the YouTube lately. But that's okay because, re um, within the past, like, two or three weeks... Uh, most of my YouTube videos are obviously Mario Maker or something else, uh, like another game I'm playing through. But aside from Halo, I, I haven't played much Mario Maker lately, like at all. So eventually I'm going to catch up on YouTube videos. That'll be nice. I'm going to play Mario Maker tomorrow, though. It's been a while. What's up? What the fuck is this? Was that all a trap to, like, get me? I think that was all a trap to, like, that woman was trying to trick me. Bandito Hogtie, okay? Yeah, I'm, I'm taking this woman with me. <laughs> Hey, I got more famous by that. That's pretty cool. Killer? What if I want to take her with me? Which one's my horse? You've got a friend in me tired of train tracks. Yeah, we can do something with this woman, surely. Take her with you on every mission. <laughs> I don't think you can. I don't think she'll. I don't think she'll last when uh when I make the next game, when I save. So I, whatever I gotta do with her, I gotta do her soon. I gotta do it soon. There are train tracks right here. 
Is there a train coming? I don't think so. New wife. Listen, she tried to fucking murder me. Let's not forget. Let's go. I need a poncho washing wench. <laughs> this poncho is getting pretty dirty. Serious core strength staying on the horse. Yo, the long fall. Thank you so much for the Twitch Prime sub. Thank you, the long fall. Can I like feed her to wolves or something? Can I? Is that is that possible? There is water here. Well, guys, I think she she is technically a sinner, and I am a I am a godly man. I think I think we just. I think we have to baptize this woman. <laughs> uh, Lord Thunderbucket, thank you so much for the 16 months. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, I will wash you of your sins, lady. She sank like a fucking stone, dude. You guys see that shit? <laughs> Good boys. Ow, the dogs are. No, no, no. I was helping you. <laughs> I was fucking helping you. Jeez. Here I am trying to fucking help the wolves, and this is what they do for my ass. Uh oh. Oh shit! Uh oh. This is getting bad. <laughs> I'm still getting attacked by wolves. The Federales! The Federales are after me, no! <laughs> right, I'm just a wildlife conser conver uh, conserva conservatizer. <laughs> Conservatist. <laughs> Stand still with your weapons holstered. Fuck that. No, sir. Conservationist. There you go. <laughs> the, for some reason, the word escaped me. Alright, we're good. Go buy a bandana. How do I... How do I buy a, a bandana? I gotta go to the bandana store. <laughs> I think I need one. Give up and let the law have me. I could just, I could also just ride for like five seconds in the other direction and be fine. Where, where actually am I right now? I have no idea. At the Bandana Republic. Oh my god. <laughs> Kill me. Um. Can I go this way? They don't come out no good. Where the fuck am I going? How do I get up here? I'm so... God damn it. I really just want to save my game. It's like all I want to do. You know, that's the thing about games like Kingdom Come was like this. It's like games where you can't save wherever you want. It's like you have to... The realistic gameplay of saving at your bed and blah blah blah. It's like... In th it sounds great in theory. The practice is... Just let me save my fucking game, bro. That's the reality. Is there a thing I can save at here? I don't want to do another mission. I just want to save. Ban Barb Toxic. I nothing would give me greater pleasure. Say no more. I'm I'm in. I will ban him. Yeah, let me just save my game anywhere. You know what I mean? I don't know. Hey. Two hundred dollars? What the fuck am I buying for two hundred dollars? You kidding me? Fine, take it. Jeez, what the fuck is worth two hundred dollars? 
Guess I'm buying a house. Alright. Save game. I bought a house, man. Pay to save. <laughs> you can camp anywhere in the wild? Can I don't know how to. Alright. Save my game. Alright. Uh, guys, that is going to do it for me tonight. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. We had some more fun with Red Dead Redemption. I don't know how much is left. I really don't know. Probably quite a bit. We might be, maybe we're like halfway or something. I honestly, uh, I honestly don't know. So, yo, uh, thank you guys so much for hanging out. Let's go ahead and let's find somebody who is streaming. And let's go throw somebody, the old host and barb raid here. Uh, thank you guys so much. Uh, let's see, who is streaming? Yeah, I think there's, I think there's quite a bit left. It's kind of a long game, I think. Who do we got? Who's streaming right now? Uh, we hosted up uh, Oats and Goats last night. Let's see. Oh, uh, you know what? I'm going to host up uh, my good buddy BK. Uh, BK is playing Ryu World. Uh, he's apparently a Goonie, just recently completely redid Ryu World. And uh, BK is playing. If you guys don't know BK, uh, he is a pretty awesome...